I'm in my kitchen today. I'm trying to triage my house. So going from most important place and this one's next. There's a few spots that I really need to address like this cupboard and a cupboard over here and drawers. Uh, lots of stuff needs to go. Anyway, I gotta get this done. And I have about an hour to do it before chaos and dinner needs to start. Okay, um, this is a lot. There are eight of us that live here. We all drink tea and half of us drink coffee. So I'm okay having extra cups, but I don't think we need this many extra. I'll take out the ones that belong to individual children right now. so much stuff. Yeah. I for sure I want to keep these cheese. I probably don't need that many cups. This one I got when I was in the hospital trying to not have my son. My water broke seven weeks before his due date and he was born on Valentine's Day, six weeks early. So this is the cup I got in the hospital, and I like it. So, keep this one. This one, the moose, the moose is right here, which means I can only see it if I am drinking it like this, but if I look, hold it like this, I get the moose butt. And if I hold it with my left hand for some reason, I just get the moose nose. I um, am not especially fond of that. Just looking at the moose butt. So, eliminate it. This, I was gonna get rid of a long time ago. This one can go. This can go. The hard part about this is some of these belong to my mom and she lives here, so I can't just get rid of her stuff. So we'll ask her, I'll put some suggested giveaways. Okay, so Which one? if we kept one, I guess maybe the anaconda one. Yeah. We'll keep this one. Can't get rid of that one. Okay, unknowns. That was actually just from the dollar store. Yeah. I don't think this means anything to anybody. Yeah. It's a nice mug though. Um, I think we can get rid of these. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm just thinking about these. They get used, but do we need them? What are these used for? Um, the kids just use them. They mostly use them like little options in them and have super tiny amounts of these like little tiny ones. Mm. I just wonder if we could not have them. Mm. Should we have a box for keep it in the garage and if we don't oh. want it? Okay, let's put those in there. These are little wine glasses that I got from a local potter when we lived in Montana. I like them, but I don't know that I ever use these. Mm -hmm. I 
really like these. And these were a collection from my mom and grandma. Um, but I was doing some research and it was all, they might contain lead and nobody knows for sure. And I'm not sure if the little lead test strips will tell me. I don't know what to do with them. I'm gonna stick them on the top and wait until I feel sure about what to do with them. Or if I find out if the test strips will work. Since I didn't want to go out and get all new glasses, we've been using jars. And it turns out these are perfect. They come with lids. They're perfect for making iced tea. And the lids on these pickles. Yeah. And the jam jar lids fit on these pickle jars. I'm gonna keep my jars. Also, the kids really like drinking out of these. So we're gonna put these in. These can go with the camping stuff. Um, well, these were a gift from grandma yeah. to me, which are a nice size. Um, we don't need these, I think. If we have these larger bowls and these smaller bowls, we can donate those. They're easily found at Walmart. We have them. I can donate this. Oh, should we donate the other one that was sitting over there? The other one that has a chip in it? That should get that away. Yeah. Huh. These are my mom's bowls, and we don't have to. Yeah. They go the steps. We'll ask her if she wants to get rid of any of those. Um, okay, we don't need to have a fourth lid. If we keep the metal bowls, we could get rid of those. Okay. Let's donate those. So we're keeping these for sure. I'm gonna ask my mom about her bowls if there's any of those that she would like to get rid of. Um, kids soup bowls, kids cereal bowls. I think there would be a mutiny if we uh, got rid of these yeah, and these. Our others is missing. Okay, we're donating that. We're gonna trash. <laughs> we're gonna trash these little plastic plates because they are some of them are like 20 years old so um, those are just trash we'll go get glass plates to replace these yeah because we do need those well, we definitely don't need this, but the plate's fine for them. And we're moving on to the first drawer. This appears to be a junk drawer, but it's not supposed to be a junk drawer. It was functioning like a junk drawer though, so we're taking all of this garbage out, which was a lot, and the stuff that didn't belong there in the first place, so that the placemats, rags, and a couple baskets could be kept in there properly without looking so chaotic.
the intention of this drawer was not to be a junk drawer, but to be to have a couple junk baskets in it and then to hold this stuff. Time is passing quickly, so one more spot for this video and um, we'll call it good. We did get rid of a lot, so uh, this drawer. No. <laughs> I'll go through that one real quick and call it a day. Okay, we can um, get rid of this. Cause that was this drawers. Yeah, you can get rid of that one. We have the nice one. Okay. Don't need this one. Um, this one feels heavier duty. Mm. Don't need that. We're gonna give this another chance. Open that. Um, I think we. If we got nuts, we would be using that. Yeah. Remember I think when we fall had is the all of those walnuts in that big bowl that was lasted a few years. Yeah. That was fun. Is this is a Yeah. stick it down there. And I just now realized where my second set of tongs went. That's fun. Okay, so even though we didn't go through the entire kitchen, we did get rid of a lot. These two things are going to the thrift store. That, we're gonna wait and see what happens if we really need to. And then there's some other stuff over there that we'll figure it out. So, hope you enjoyed decluttering with me today. I will probably do another kitchen declutter at some point, but I might move on to a different space now that I got the hot spots taken care of and come back to the kitchen a little bit later. <laughs>